Atmosphere allows us to make custom track field placeholders so they are visible and searchable on the process reporting page. Let's take a look at how to do this. Custom track fields are visible and searchable on the process reporting page. Track field labels are operation independent, so different processes and operations can specify the same label and populate the same field. One thing I want to point out, some connectors have properties, like a disk file name, or an FTP directory, or an email subject, where you can refer to or set dynamically elsewhere in the process. The help topics for each connector list for tracked property types are displayed on the Manage Menus Process Reporting page for each document received or sent. Enabling document tracking within a process is four simple steps. You must add the track field labels. Bind the track field label to the actual field. Package and deploy the process. View the new track field column in process reporting. Now document tracking is enabled in our process. Let's discuss the document level search features available to us. This is located in Manage Process Reporting and then select the Documents view. From here, we can select filters to display different search criteria. For Track Searching, which allows us to search for specific atoms, connector types, track fields, and execution IDs. We can choose Unique Track Fields from the Add Filter dropdown. Now I'm going to demonstrate exercise number 20, Document Tracking. This is in your book from pages 91 to 98. To add a custom field, we'll begin by going to the Setup menu. From here, we will go down to Document Tracking. Document Tracking is located under Developer Resources. It's the last item. I am going to click on the plus symbol and add an account. An account is going to be a character field. I will then click on the OK button. I will now go into the Build tab. We're going to be looking at process that we have under Administrator 1, Account XML to CSV. We're going to go ahead and click on Account XML Get. And we're going to click on the Tracking tab. We're going to add a plus symbol for the tracked field. It will list all the track fields we have available. Well, we only have one track field, Account, so it lists that. We're going to highlight it and click OK. Next, we're going to assign it a field value. We're going to click on the plus symbol to add the parameter. We're going to select Profile Element. The profile type will be XML. We will select the profile, which is going to be Account XML, and then we will choose the field that we want to use, which is going to be the company name. We will then click on the OK button. You can have up to 1,000 characters in the track field value. If the track field value is longer than 1,000, it is going to cut to 1,000 characters when it is created and stored. We're now going to click Save and Close. We're going to click Save and Close again. It is time to package and deploy your process. Your activity guide contains the details you need to enter for package components and deploying your process. The video will continue with the step after your process is deployed. Pause the video now to package and deploy your process. We will now execute the process under the Atom Cloud. The process is now ran. We will click on the hyperlink, the date time hyperlink, to bring up the document statistics. On the start connector, we will click on successes. Notice that it has brought up the account name. The account name was not there before, so this is our document tracking field. We are bringing it up. This gives us the name of the company. Bacal Corp. You can highlight Bacal Corp. And this will give you the account name. 
We're going to right click on this and save and copy the file name. We'll return back to process reporting. Next to the word extension where the blue drop down is, we will select documents. We can narrow down our criteria by clicking on add filter. Now we can uh, filter in the document level by atoms, connector types, track field, or execution ID. We're going to select track fields. We're going to highlight our track field, and then what we will do is we will paste in Bacal Corp. This is the only one that we have, which is why it is displayed. This concludes our document tracking demonstration. Now it's your turn to try document tracking. This is in your book on page 91 to 98. When we return, we will be discussing component locking.